Hey there, uh, fellow do-it-yourselfers. I am um, was looking to replace the tires on my yard cart, and what, if, what I had was I had the wheels from my old lawnmower on there front this one got a uh, has a rust hole in it so it won't hold air anymore i'm gonna you know put slime or whatever in it and i'll try to try to limp it along but in the meantime i had went to harbor freight and i wanted to get um one of their 13 inch wheels because i had a coupon for it it was like 7.99 or whatever and i was actually i'd actually got the run flat tire was a solid tube before i got this one and the reason i took the 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 run flat one back um is not run flat but it was actually just a solid tire it the 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 shaft that it that was the bearing that rides on the shaft was this size um or this size it was actually this size this is half inch by one and three eighths the one and three eighths being here whatever that's called outside diameter i guess so that's out it's this is a, called a flange bearing so if you're searching for it online, it's one and three eighths. Okay. So anyway, I couldn't fit this onto the shaft. So I was going to grind it down. I was going to put a bushing in here. I was gonna... so finally, I had went to the to the. I popped them out. I went to the hardware store. And I went to look, and... Lo and behold, they sell the bearing that's the right size. Now this is three quarter. The the shaft will measure out a little bit over five eight but it does not fit a five eight it's not a five eight shaft um because this is five eights and um i don't know if you can see there it's a little bit over five eights or close to five eights right but it's actually it will not it has to go on to this a three quarter because this is the actual size that the lawnmower and yard carts are this size, the half inch, excuse me, the half inch or five eighths, half inch basically, is for uh, dollies, carts, um, smaller applications. This is what comes with the Harbor Freight wheel. This one was seven ninety nine, I think, with the coupon. It's a thirteen inch tire, and this is from my yard cart, so I could take it to compare it. Now the problem is when I went to my local hardware store. The first, my first attempt, they were all, they had all these bearings in the three quarter. And I was like, why is this not fitting? Well, basically what happened is everybody in my neighborhood has ran up to the hardware store, popped out the bearings, found the right side bearing, and then either just left these or just walked out the door with the ones they needed. So I was left with only one that I could actually get. Now, this one was $5 at the store, at the local hardware store, and but you can get them, I think, online for about a buck 50. I think I think there's a tire manufacturer called Marathon that will sell these bearings for a buck 50 a piece, I think. But um I guess if you looked around online you could get it. So, all right. So, I hope that helps everybody. I mean, this is not the same width as the one that I took off, but it's better than me trying to mess with that and and hobble that along. So, when I can get a new one for $8, pop it on couple bearings and i'm good to go and then hopefully you know you know next time when this tire goes bad they get to pop the bearing out and put it in your new hub so i hope that helps anybody who's you know before they make 20 trips to the store like i did trying to figure out what to do all right thanks